Man, welcome back! Again. Yes! Yeah. First or not? Does that thing have boobs? Yes. Ah, pointy face and boobs. <laughs> so deceiving. Hey? I don't know. I, and it's got an external rib cage. It's like alien. Alien ribs in your face with a pointy face and boobs. Yes! It's also very hairy. Unlike aliens. Yeah, aliens don't have yeah, oh. It annoys me when people draw red aliens with dreadlocks. Because, like, when the normal alien comes out, it doesn't have a head of hair like humans do. Okay. And, and the dog alien in Alien 3 wasn't covered in fur. So why would a bread alien have, have dreadlocks? Yeah, you see? Okay. It makes perfect sense. I just need to quickly explain a couple of things about Aeons. Um, they all have sensors, so you can all see what the enemies attack some... Uh, health and weaknesses are, ah, and if you press right, you get to the sub menu, shield and boost. Uh, if you use the shield, then you'll take less damage, however, your overdrive gauge will build up quicker. And if you use boost, hang on, I forget. It stands for Andrew Eats Onion Nuts. Okay, good. Anyway, use boost, more damage, but your overdrive meter fills up faster. And now it's full, and we get to use Energy Ray. And I've just completely forgotten something. Uh-huh. We didn't pick up Veil for secondary. <laughs> Thing magic. You what now? Um, Veil 4 has a second overdrive, and we've forgotten to go get it. Okay. And we can't go get it again. Uh-huh. You suck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. that thing was anorexic. It, it's a bloody... Ugh. I don't care, it's still anorexic. <laughs> His slowness of running annoys me. Sorry. There's, oh, it spends way too much time in the air. I mean, I know it's Final Fantasy and they spend a lot of time in the air. Yeah. You know, especially if you play, like, the city. It's like... Everyone hates the floor in that game. Just, yeah, it suits in that, but when you're just running like that, it's annoying. No problem. You just want to be, huh? He was complaining about fighting it not so long ago. No, no, but now... Dark Attacks! And yes, we're keeping all these fights in because they're tutorial-ish. Ah, uh, you can hit in the face. Oh. It's like a big game of dodgeball. And when you have darkness inflicted upon you... You can't see very well. Plus, your accuracy is very low and you can very rarely hit and kill things. Nobody likes that darkness. Steve! Ruining your eyes. Wuchang! Do you think it'd be awesome? If you could have a torch, but instead of light, it shines darkness. Um, what use would that be? Making things dark. It's like you go out at daytime and you turn on your night torch. Oh, blizzard. The, the place that you find it at is dark. You, you could trick owls. You kind of go outside and you see an owl. You wait until the sun comes and then you turn it on and it goes, oh, it's still night. So the point of your invention is owl terrorism. Yes. Good. Yeah, you can just do that. It could be other stuff. <laughs> It's like, in films, they could get really big ones for filming night scenes. I suppose. Although you'd have to be careful, because if the camera showed too much of the background, they'd see the place that wasn't in the torches stuff, and then... Yeah. It, it, that'd be weird. It'd or be if like, you're UA Bold, you just don't bother with consistency. Don't mention him to me. Sorry. We've cited so many of his films, like, one shot is night, when it's day. No, not you. His films don't deserve existence. Line of Captive! He has Dark Touch, which is... Pretty useless, no, 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 no. actually. We can't say much about you, a ball, before I still try and punch us. Yes. Because he's a boxer. I don't care, I still hate him. <laughs> I'll just hide a knife in my boxing glove. Should we move on? No. Oh. Sorry, sorry I've, ma I've made you dwell on this. Next thing you know, you a ball will be making a Final Fantasy X film, and it'll have, like, I don't know, Chuck Norris's Steve. How's that bad? I don't know. Chuck Norris. Kill the ground things with Steve. Steve. Ah, that's been good. Oh, that feels horrible. Yeah, things for work. Uh... <laughs> uh, a ball seems like a very strange weapon. And magic for Lobby. Uh, Lobby, that's the one. He just tried to stab us in the face. Who? Steve, he just threw his sword at us. <laughs> no, Did he, he not see? No. 
As the, the camera was going. It looked to, like he was trying to stab himself. The, in the camera face. was going to boob lady, and he threw the sword at the camera and missed. He was trying to kill us. Yes. Because Steve is an asshole, and he runs in slow motion. <laughs> So you can enjoy all the beautiful scenery. I don't care about scenery. I want to stab things in the face. So Avatar. <laughs> That's what you watch Avatar for. Exactly. See pretty things. Not for running in slow motion. Now we're going to go on a boat. A boat that moves in slow motion. No. Do you have to run in slow motion on the boat? Um. Touch the thing. No, I don't need to. Oh, well you suck. Oh, actually I do. Yeah, I see. Sorry. See, that's the second time. Why did today. I pick up Vale for second overdrive? Because you Anyway, talk to the lady who has the dog, then go find the dog, and then go back to the lady's house. Look in the dog's mouth, talk you'll have Fluffy. a thing, it'll give you an overdrive talk, for Vale for. Talk, talk to Fluffy. Hang on, are the, are the Aurochs here? Or they, was it Fluffy or stuff. Fluffums? I can't remember. Fluffums. Ah, uh, Fluffums. You know, I read the book called Fluffy before. By Sam It was awesome. What's going on here? They're all stood there. They're looking at fluffums. No, they're looking at Wacker's insane hair. Ooh, secret going, Jesus ring. Christ, how much jail do Give you Give me use? things! Yay, they're giving me money and stuff, and now I'm going to equip a Seeker's ring to Yuna. Ooh, HP 10%. That was very, very good, actually. Everybody likes 10%. Alcohol. Ooh. I don't know. That'll give you a kick. I wouldn't know. Most alcohol's about... Four to five percent. I don't drink. Silly boy, missing out on lots. Look how happy Fluffums is. Yes. It looks like the thing around his neck is teeth. And he has a really big beard. Oh. Oh, she was sad. They're all killing. So, oh, I thought he was going to run off the edge then. Ha. Oh. Too bad, crying kid. So you deserve. Very <laughs> stupid headband. Random bow. No, that's how come the boat's moving away, but it's still attached? Because anyway, that bow thing was a prayer. It was a rubbish prayer. <laughs> but then it's not really even kneel. I don't know, but it's more oh. interesting than just going and kneeling, isn't it? I don't care. That's a real prayer. <laughs> Unless you're from a different religion, then then other things. Right, so we're going from stuff. Brissade to Kilika. Uh, and then we're going to take a transfer or boat to Luca. This boat's very frilly. Frilly? It has lots of fancy swirls on. Yay! Let's steal this guy's binoculars! Close your eyes now and guess what sounds out there. Give me your binoculars! It really is Final Fantasy. He's a monkey! <laughs> And he's still in his binoculars. Just like a monkey would do. Monkeys are always stealing. Hey, hey. Hey. Oh, that was right. <laughs> ah! She's been stabbed in the head. Yes. Twice. Oh no! Dirty Steve. Her, 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 her. Look at that side, boo. Oh, God. <laughs> Hi there. Ah! Oh, shit, I wasn't looking at you. I mean, I was, I was looking... The sky! The sky is side, boo. <laughs> what? Everybody loves sky, boo. Yes. Sky, boo. See? You see? See what I did there? Half sky, half side. You're insane. I'm a genius. Right, let's talk to him. Because he has insane hair. <laughs> You know, have you ever seen that film with Cameron Diaz and Ben Stiller? Uh, to be more specific. I can't remember what it's called, but it's it, it's about sex, basically. And he, yeah, he goes off, and he's on a date with her, and he gets some stuff on his ear, and she goes, hey, and she gets it off and gels her hair up with it. His hair looks like that. Hmm. He looks a little bit like James. He does a bit, only diminished goatee. Let's talk to him. Yeah, yeah, talk to Fluffums. Fluffums says he loves you. No, he's just followed his art. He didn't want to talk to us. 
No, that's a sign of love. Yes. Go, there's a ball on the floor. Which Go we'll, poom it. Which we'll come to poom. next time. Poom. See you then.